Hi everyone, it's been a while since I did a video, so I wanted to show what's in my bag. And this is a Speedy Bandolier size 40. It is the biggest bandolier they have, and then it goes to the Keepa 45 and 50, 55, and 60. Um, I was I had traveled down to Florida to visit my family, so I decided to take this um, for the plane ride because it holds so much. So I just want to show you what fits inside. Um, I actually had a vest. A Patagonia vest stuffed in here and a sweatshirt and then I I couldn't fit anything else in here after that but those I had already taken out um, but my primary bag I used down there because I was only down there for a few days um, is the pochette um, accessoire or accessories pochette and this is the new model so in here I have and I have the long detachable strap on it too so I can wear a crossbody um, I have this is my favorite Louis Vuitton wallet it's the Sarah compact wallet I love it um let me see if I can I love accordion style wallets because that way you can see everything you have um so that's one of my favorites it's in here great um I have EPS slips or receipts um this is my favorite gum and it's aspartame free which I love and I picked it up at Home Goods. There's a fire truck outside with Santa in it, so you're going to be hearing a lot of <laughs> noise going on. Um, so that's empty. Okay, this is a pair of Tommy Bahama Coco Palm sunglasses. They're polarized. I don't know if I can get them out, but I do love these. They're like a brown. And there's a story behind this. I had bought a new a wallet, brand new from Nordstrom Rack. I'm gonna have it in here, so I'll pull it out. And this was inside of it. But what's weird is you could kind of tell if somebody had tried it or tested it, but I think it just slipped in it because everything looked perfect. And they had other ones too, so I don't know. This is my makeup bag. It's, I just have mainly lip, lipsticks, lip glosses. Um, what else, like hand sanitizer. Um, and some Advil just in case. This is just a little pouch of my earbuds and when I fly I always pop these in my ears because my ears are really sensitive to pressure um, and just these are wireless ones. Okay this is the, so this is the wallet I had mentioned I purchased at Nordstrom Rack down in Florida. It's um, by Marc Jacobs but it's weird. Here I'm gonna unzip it. Ooh, sorry if I'm moving the camera too much. But see how it's like perfectly, like it has never been touched. And you really couldn't zip it all the way either because of this middle part. So that's why I'm like, that's so weird. I found that inside of it. Um, and then I, I picked up the matching um, coin key fob wallet. I mean, a uh, holder. It's hot pink. How can I say no to that? <laughs> this way I can always find it in the bag. <laughs> Okay, so this is a book I'm currently reading. I'm only on chapter one. <laughs> um, it's Apocalyptic by Sue Margolis. So far, so good. I like it. Her, it's easy to read. Um, I'm going to put it on the floor because I'm running out of room up here. This is a Louis Vuitton um, scarf. It's the Damier Azor one. So it's, I love it because it doesn't have any wool in it. I have the denim one. It has wool in it and it tends to feel very scratchy on me um, but during a cold day you can't complain I have the honest wipes um, these are MCM these are for I have I had LASIK eye surgery back in 2008 and only recently I need I need a very light prescription for distance so I mainly wear them to for when driving because my eyes are usually tired by nighttime so we're getting there. Still got a lot to go. <laughs> this baby holds a lot. <laughs> okay. So let go. This is a charger. I don't have my name marked on it so nobody takes it. <laughs> so I have that. That one's a six foot cable. I have the 10 foot cable. Man, that thing's so big. So I was like, I don't need something that big. So I picked up a six foot. This is, um, I think it's pronounced Larage. Larage. 
and I just keep two pens in it and I still have room for more because you could probably stick another two or three pens in here. Just receipts from Target. Um, my boarding pass. Um, let's see. This is my Louis Vuitton put, um, clay. And these candies. Love them. <laughs> They're so good. Okay. So I this bag I did purchase pre-owned, but it was in, it looked in perfect shape, but it had a funky smell to it. And it wasn't like it was almost like a stale, almost like a, a stale perfume with a hint of cigarette in it. So I kept it inside out and I would take it outside and let air out for like hours. And finally it, it cleared out, but I still keep these in here just to kind of prevent it from coming back. Because sometimes with like, I don't know, I don't see a cigarette smell, but with that, I don't know what it is. It was like a, not musty, hard to explain, but... I always worry of it, like ever, like to if it reappears. <laughs> so I keep that in there to prevent that. Um, this is a Vera Bradley coin holder, but I actually keep my jewelry in here. I actually keep this in my gym bag. So when I go in the morning, I just have all my jewelry in here. So I have like um, a Michelle watch. Uh, so I have that. I have hoop earrings. These I picked up like almost 20 years ago at like a five and dime store and I still wear them. They're my favorite and I can't find anything like them. They're like great. <laughs> These are my Juice Plus um, Chewy Vitamins. This is just the, the key and lock. Okay, so that's it for the pocket. Let's see what else we got in here. Um, I got my Beats headphones in here. My other boarding pass and a card from my parents for Christmas. Let's see. And that's it. She's all empty, so I'm actually gonna switch out of her, um, put everything away, like the bag and the um, and this one, and I'm gonna switch my wallets to give it a break, and I'm gonna switch into this one. So um, I hope this helps. You know, see so an idea of what actually fits in here. Like I couldn't believe how much I fit in there. And there was something else I had in there. I was like, wow, I can't, I'm so impressed at how much this actually fits. <laughs> so if you're thinking of buying one for travel, I highly recommend it. Um, I do like it that you can zip it. Um, I do have a Neverfull GM. And to carry the GM is actually, oh, it's about the same because you have the strap on this. And I just keep it at shoulder length um, so it's easier to carry. But um, the only thing is I like this because it's zipped. The Neverfull doesn't zip. So I always worry about, you know, um, people lurking in your bag. <laughs> so um, I hope you all have a wonderful Christmas and I will see you soon. Bye.